Gentleman's and now yield one minute to a very active member of our committee, the gentleman from Colorado, Mr. Perlmutter. Gentleman from Colorado is recognized for one minute. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. <clears throat> I rise in support of the manager's amendment and the bill. Uh, we are in a position where $350 billion without any conditions is likely to be passed or it's been requested and likely will go out the door. These conditions are important and the conditions that are added through the manager's amendment are, sp are particularly important. One of the things we talked about with the original TARP bill was that money would, one, buy mortgage portfolios, two, recapitalize banks, and three, pass through various agencies to small businesses, to, through the federal home loan banks, and through the Farm Credit Administration. This manager's amendment makes sure that money passes directly to people on Main Street, including the home builders that Mr. Burton was just talking about, commercial realtors, commercial real estate, farmers, municipal bond dealers, so that all credit across the board is available to people and get this economy back on track and loosen up credit across the United States. And I support the uh, manager's amendment and ask for an aye vote. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Time has expired.